everyone, Belinda here from Horror Tree, back again with another dose of my Horror Tree weekly wrap up. And today, as usual, I'll be talking about four submission calls that are currently up on the Horror Tree website. So let's get started. Okay, first up is Diet Milk Magazine. Now, these guys are a biannual, biannual literary, literary magazine devoted to gothic prose, poetry, and art. Neatly genre or genre bending, classically styled or modern, they want your prettiest, most pungent dread. They want you to give them their withering romance, creatures that lurk and lure, families to be feared and houses that haunt. Give them isolation and creeping, oppressive unwellness. Quietly thrill, terrify, and leave them wanting more. Now, all submissions or submissions must fall under the gothic umbrella but aren't required to be a specific genre no reprints or multiple subs are welcome are welcome for this submission call guys now they are after prose authors may submit up to one short story at a time up to five thousand words they are up to art after art sorry an artist may submit up to two pieces at a time and poets may submit up to three poems at a time, but no poem should exceed five pages in length. Payment is $15 per poem, 0.01 cent per word or $40 minimum for short stories and $50 per piece of artwork. Submission window opens on the 1st of December and closes on the 8th of January, 2024. Okay, moving on to many worlds. now. These guys welcome submissions by those who identify with and as any of the following descriptors. Trans, two-spirit, disabled, neurodivergent, mad with a capital M, queer, crip, non-binary, genderqueer, intersex. This is a space for the words, works and worlds of and by those whose body minds defy social ex expectations and invite new ways of thinking and knowing um, they don't need to know the specifics of your identity diagnosis experience unless you wish to share and they invite closeted and questioning people to share their work as well as those whose experiences fall outside of the confines of the language we used they used above but they also welcome submissions from creators of all ages and they particularly encourage unpublished, emerging and young creators to submit. Now, I do suggest you jump on the website to check out this submission call if you are interested because there is a bit more information than what I can give you guys here. Payment, I believe, is $10 and the submission window opens on the 1st of December and closes the 31st of Jan 2024. Next up is the first line. Now, these guys are open to all genres but the story must begin with mr morton needed a new pair of shoes i'll say that again mr morton needed a new pair of shoes now they are after fiction poetry non-fiction multiple submissions are okay and they are also looking for four part four part stories the only catch is it has to start your piece of work, your bit of creativeness has to start with the line, Mr. Morton needed a new pair of shoes. That first line cannot be altered in any way. Okay, a lot of details for this submission call, guys. Far too much for me to go into in this video. So if you are interested, jump on the Horror Tree website. All the information you need is up there. Um, I can tell you they pay $25 between 25 and 50 for fiction, $10 for poetry, and $25 for non-fiction. They also send you a copy of the issue in which your piece appears. This is due the 1st of February. So again, if you are interested, please jump on the Horror Tree website, check it out. Okay, last and certainly not least, because they never are, is Black Beacon Books Ghost Story Anthology. Love it love it okay so they are looking for subtle and atmospheric ghost stories that give the reader a chill for 
read so again another one where i suggest if you are interested please jump on the website and check out the submission call because it is a detailed one and it actually gives you examples to get you in the mood so and i hope the thunderstorm you can hear in the background is helping get you in the mood to write a great atmospheric creepy ghost story I might even give it a go. <laughs> okay, their after stories are between 3,000 to 9,000 words. Now, they pay 25 US dollars for original stories and $10 for $10 US for reprints, regardless of length, plus one print copy. Now, they only pay via PayPal. If you don't have PayPal, an alternative option is an Amazon gift card. So, Submissions close on the 31st of December, so get cracking. And that's it, guys. Another amazing week of amazing submission calls by amazing publishers and some really fantastic opportunities to get creating, get your work out there, get yourself loved, get yourself adored because you all deserve it. So if any of these submission calls appeal to you, all the information you need is up on the Horror Tree website. Get on there, check it out. And if you are going to submit, all the absolute best of luck to you. And as always, thank you for watching these videos. We really do appreciate it. If you are enjoying them, hit like, hit subscribe, hit share. Tell your friends, tell your workmates, tell your writers who don't really know where to find information on submission calls. Everything you need is right here. Okay, and as always, thank you for watching again. And until next time, guys, stay safe, stay cool, and stay spooky. See you later.